Durastrike is a fly bait, uh, and it's the newest one in our lineup at Star Bar. It's actually a class 22A insecticide, uh, which is nice because it's a completely different class of chemistry than our other three baits, different active ingredient, different mode of action. In our lineup of fly baits, we have Golden Malrin, Quick Strike, Cyanorox, and now Durastrike. All four of those are four different active ingredients. There are four different classes of chemistry, four different modes of action. The reason that's good is because you don't have to keep using the same product year after year. A lot of times we hear in the field, this product isn't what it used to be or it doesn't work like it used to, and that's not necessarily the case. What, what's happening is flies are building resistance to that active, and it's time to rotate to a different active. Durastrike could be put into an integrated pest management program at a, a down low product to use for killing adults. So Durastrike you could put into, in layer houses, you could put it down in pits, uh, in swine barns, same thing. You can put it down on floors, walkways, alleyways, and flies come to it and they feed on it and they die. So in a good IPM program, an adulticide like that that's down low where flies are going to feed is a good product to have in place. Exalt WDG, that stands for Water Dissolvable Granule. Exalt is a dry product and it's a larvicide. So unlike the adulticides that we talk about in our fly baits and things like that, this is going after the juveniles. So Exalt you would apply in fly breeding areas and you can apply it either dry the way it comes packaged at one pound per thousand square feet or you can mix it into a liquid so that dissolvable granule mixes and dissolves well and at the spray application rate it's half a pound per thousand square feet. Using Exalt in an IPM program is a key part to making sure that we're not just getting the adults but we're also getting juveniles. So when you use Exalt, the active ingredient Novaluron that's going to block chitin synthesis on those juveniles. So we're getting adults with other programs and products that were put together in this IPM. And then we're also getting the juveniles so you don't constantly have new flies emerging. I think it's important to note that the star bar line continues to grow. As we talked about our, our scatter baits earlier, we've got four different classes of chemistry because we recognize rotation's important and we want you to be able to do that within the Star Bar brand. The fact that we continue to add more products, whether it's new larvicides that can be direct applied or feed through products, things like that, it shows that we're really focused on insect control and just insect control.